You like to go for a ride? <laughs> you want to go for a ride? Oh yeah, you like that. Any chance to get outside during a winter's day and midnight is all ears. But last Monday morning, as Tim Kerfman was taking out the garbage, she didn't want him to take her for a car ride. Instead, she wanted him to follow her next door. Well, she just had her ears kind of perked up and looking at me like, you know, like she just don't normally do that. So I knew some, you know, it's just you get, sometimes you just get that feeling something's up. As Tim followed midnight, she took him to a spot on the other side of the house. That's where he found his 87-year-old neighbor lying in the snow. She had fallen while trying to fill her bird feeder. Figured she was out there at least a half an hour. She could not get up because her gloves had gotten wet and, you know, she just didn't have enough strength in her fingers to push herself up and there's nothing on the garage to get a hold of on the around the corner to get a hold of to get up either. At the time, the temperature was about one below. Tim got his neighbor Noreen inside and his wife helped her get into dry clothes. Noreen told me she's shy and didn't want to be on camera, but she did say that midnight definitely saved her in the nick of time. Sort of like Lassie, it's how midnight saved the day. And that morning, man's best friend also became the neighbor lady's best friend and personal hero. We've been very proud of her because, you know, it, it's it's not every dog that, you know, pays attention to things like this. And she got so many treats, it was a shame. <laughs> In Alexandria, John Lordson, WCCO 4 News.